Jesus today is teaching us how to pray. He's basically telling us that prayer is an act of self-emptying, an act of self-surrender, an act of self-abandoning. The moment we put ourselves in the mood of prayer, or the moment we decide that we are going to, to pray, at that very moment, we are emptying ourselves. We are surrendering ourselves before God so that God may take charge. Wherever we are, when we are praying, we are standing on holy grounds. And therefore, in that very place, like Moses did when he saw the burning bush, we are to take off the shoes of self-sufficiency, the shoes of self-fulfillment, so that God may be the one to direct us during that moment of prayer. We have to empty ourselves, to open ourselves, to open these hands, so that God begins to fill us up with himself and with his graces. That is why in the Lord's Prayer, the phrase, may your kingdom come, implies the opposite, that my own kingdom should go. If we pray that the kingdom of God should come and yet I'm still sitting on my throne as my own king, then where will that kingdom of God rest in me? If we do not empty ourselves, if we do not abandon ourselves, then our prayer is but just mere words. Amen.